coming in. I'm glad I was able to find that for wow, you. Wow, thank you so much. Oh, you're it's welcome. Uh, Shine Mountain Skunk. There it is, right there. Many people right just there. have jobs, and I think I have an avocation. We found out how to repair books today. Doug showed us how to do that with the glue you use and how you do it. That was uh, very useful for us. In fact, we're going down the street to buy the archival glue that he recommended. <laughs> That's right. Now we love books, and obviously Doug does as well. And it's it's fun to come visit him. He's a very nice man. He's always been really helpful and knowledgeable every time I come in. When I was younger, I didn't like reading books because I didn't know how to read books, so it felt kind of boring unless my mom or my dad was reading it to me. But now that I'm older, I love reading books. This is a very special bookstore. It's more than just coming to work and opening up and selling books. This is what I do. This is what's in my heart and soul. You can order whatever you want. He can find it. If he doesn't have it in his warehouse. He's just got a great selection of neat books here. Stressed con Pre-stressed concrete. Okay, SB457. This bookstore was opened originally in 1946 by my father, Henry A. Clausen. This is the location my wife and I opened in 2000 after a search for a better location. Here I am for the last 15 years in this location with my own business, selling books the way I want to sell them. So I feel very fortunate standing next to books that may have been in my father's bookstore at one time, that are now in here. I feel a responsibility to take care of these books and to treat them with respect and hope that they will go to people who will also treat them with respect and will love them like I love them. That's what I want for this bookshop, to be remembered as a place you could go to find a really good book.